Kumusta kayong muli, grade 6 learners? Fourth quarter, this time our topic, relationship of volume of prisms and pyramids and other 3D figures. After going through this lesson, you are expected to determine the relationship of the volume between a rectangular prism and a pyramid, a cylinder and a cone, and a cylinder and a sphere. Hi pupils! I know you are very excited because it is the first lesson of the fourth quarter. In this lesson, you will be able to know the relationship between the volumes of a prism to a pyramid. To start this lesson, look at the figures below. How many cubic units are there in one layer? How many layers fill the figure? In the figures, it has 24 cubic units in one layer and it has 8 layers. If you are going to count the total number of cubic units in the figure, it has 192 cubic units which represent the volume of this figure. If you can still remember that volume of a rectangular prism is the product of its length, width, and height. According to the book 21st Century Matlitz 2016, volume of a prism is the amount of space inside it and it is measured in cubic units, which means it tells you how many cubes of a given size it takes to fill the prism. What if we are to get the volume of a pyramid where in the dimensions of the base and its height is the same as the given rectangular prism. Will you be able to determine the number of cubic units inside the pyramid? Let us take a look at this figure. Let us fill the rectangular prism with water using the pyramid. The figure shows that if you fill the rectangular prism with water using a pyramid whose base and the height is the same as the given rectangular prism, it takes three pyramids to fill in a rectangular prism. Therefore, the volume of the given prism is 192 cubic units. Then, the volume of the pyramid is 192 divided by 3 equals 64 cubic units. Vice versa, if the volume of the given pyramid is 64 cubic units, therefore, volume of the rectangular prism is 64 times 3 equals 192. What if we have to pour water in a cylinder using a cone of the same base and height? It takes three cones to fill in the cylinder. The cone and the cylinder have the same base and height. Example, find the volume of the cone inside the cylinder. 
The cone and cylinder have the same base and height. The volume of cylinder is 288 cubic units. To find the volume of cone, volume equals 288 divided by 3. And that is 96 cubic units. And that is the volume of cone. Another example. Find the volume of the cylinder. The cone and cylinder have the same base and height. Volume of cone is 78 cubic units. The volume of cylinder is 3 times the volume of cone. Therefore, to get the volume of the cylinder in the example, volume equals 78 cubic units times 3 equals 234 cubic units. What if we have to pour water in a cylinder using a spear of the same base and height? The volume of a spear is two-thirds of the volume of a cylinder. The cylinder and the spear have the same base and height. Example, find the volume of the spear inside the cylinder. The spear and the cylinder have the same base and height. If the volume of a cylinder is 42 cubic units, Let's find out the volume of spear. So, volume equals 2 thirds times 42. 2 times 42 equals 84 divided by 3 equals volume equals 28 cubic units. And that is the volume of a spear. Another example. Find the volume of the cylinder. The spear and cylinder have the same base and height. The volume of the spear is 51 cubic units. The volume of a spear is two-thirds of the volume of a cylinder. Therefore, to get the volume of the cylinder in the example, Volume equals 51 times 3 halves. And that is 153 cubic units divided by 2. So volume equals 76.5 cubic units. And that is the volume of the cylinder. Therefore, from the given examples, we say that if the prism and pyramid have the same base and height, it takes three pyramids to fill in the volume of the prism, or we could say that the volume of pyramid is one-third the volume of the prism with the same base and height. Learning task 1. Find the volume of the second picture using the volume of the first given. The given solid figures have the same base and height. Number 1. The volume of a cylinder is 78 cubic centimeters. Find the volume of the cone. Since a cone is one-third the volume of a cylinder, therefore, 78 cubic centimeters divided by 3, so the volume of cone is 26 cubic centimeters. Number 2. The volume of the pyramid is 36 cubic centimeters. Find the volume of the prism. Since the volume of the pyramid is one-third of the volume of the prism, therefore, volume equals 36 cubic centimeters times 3. So the volume of a prism is 108 
cubic centimeters. Number 3. The volume of the cylinder is 198 cubic meters. Find the volume of the given sphere. The volume of a sphere is two-thirds of the volume of a cylinder. Therefore, volume equals 198 cubic meters times two-thirds. 198 times 2 equals 396 divided by 3. Therefore, the volume of a sphere is 132 cubic meters. Can you answer number 4 and number 5? Learning task 2 Using cardboard or a folder, create a rectangular prism and pyramid given that their dimensions are the same. Using the solid figures, prove that it takes 3 pyramids to fill in a prism with the same base and height. Then complete the statement below. Number 1. Volume of the pyramid equals blank times volume of rectangular prism. Number 2. For rectangular prism, volume equals length times width times blank. Number 3. So for pyramid, Volume equals length times width times height blank. This is the rubric on how you will be graded in this learning task. Submit the solid figures during the retrieval of answer sheet. Learning task 3. Read its question carefully, then write the letter of the correct answer. Number 1. What is the relationship of the volume between a prism and a pyramid of the same dimensions? A. The volume of the pyramid is two-thirds of the volume of the prism. B. The volume of the pyramid is three-thirds of the volume of the prism. C. The volume of the pyramid is one-third of the volume of the prism. D. The volume of the pyramid is three halves of the volume of the prism. Number two. The volume of a cone is blank the volume of a cylinder if both of the same dimensions. A double, B thrice, C twice, D four times. Number three. How many cones can fill the whole sphere with the same dimension? A1, B2, C3, D4. If the volume of a cylinder is 120 cubic meters, what will be the volume of a cone with the same dimension? A180 cubic meters, B60 cubic meters, C, 40 cubic meters. D, 30 cubic meters. Number 5. What is the length of the edge of a cube if it has a volume of 27 cubic inches? A, 9 inches. B, 6 inches. C, 3 inches. D, 2 inches. Maraming salamat muli sa pagsama nyo sa atin sa ating video. Kung nagustuhan nyo ang ating video, please like and subscribe at pindutin na rin ang notification bell para updated kayo sa mga bago pang darating na videos. Pwede kayo mag-comment at syempre, please share this to your classmates. Hanggang sa muli, paalam!